By the end of this course, you will be using the Primavera P6 with confidence and build and control your project schedule with great ease, efficiently and effectively. Because today, Primavera is not only one of the most popular project management software in the world, it also powers and drive your entire project's work starting from planning, scheduling, executing, monitoring and control of your projects, programs and portfolios. Now without further delay, let me give you a quick overview that how this course is organized, the practice activities we are going to perform together and also what exactly you are going to learn in this Primavera P6 course. Please remember, this course is going to give you a great mix of lessons with practical exercises which are designed to give you the knowledge that many other Primavera P6 beginners simply don't have. In the second section, we will talk about the project schedule building process in general, what steps are required to perform while building any type of project schedule. In case, if the Primavera is not installed on your laptop, we will discuss the procedure to download and install the latest Primavera P6 software from the Oracle website. We will begin with very simple sample project schedule that we will discuss throughout the course step by step. So I'll keep it straight forward just to make it easy for you to build and solidify your project scheduling concepts using Primavera P6 software. Throughout the course, I will help you learn the important concepts of various project scheduling and control tasks. So once the basic project schedule building steps are understood, then we will learn to create enterprise project structure and creation of a new project. We will perform the procedure to configure Primavera P6 preferences and calendars. I will help you create the work breakdown structure and its related activities. Then we will see how to customize the Gantt charts and will learn adding constraints to the different project activities. Also, I will discuss about setting up and assign baseline then we'll go through and add projects resources to the Primavera P6 database. After this, setting up and handling of the project cost will also be examined during the training. We will demonstrate and learn about printing project layouts, importing and exporting of the projects in different file formats. So in this course, you are gonna learn tons of new stuff like how to structure and organize your project schedule and to actually think about the various features of Primavera P6 that you will use to build your project schedule with confidence and ease. I hope you are going to have fun with the course. You will be confident using Primavera P6 and learn all of its core features, solid foundation and core concepts so that you will take your Primavera P6 knowledge to the next level. And that's really all what I want to achieve with this course. So let's move and finally get started.